picked up a couple of these today at Walgreens. I busted into one of them already. Um, football collector's edge. Got some single cards in there, probably 20 or 30 of those in a couple of packs. One in four contains a hit. I really don't know what they consider a hit. Maybe some random parallel or maybe get an autograph. But I went ahead and ripped, some, ripped this thing open because they got this thing really glued in here nice. Let's see what we got going on in here. Georgia Tech, really good buddy of mine, played football there. Maybe I'll get his card. And Notre Dame. The Notre Dame cards seem to be a, a pretty common theme in these boxes. Let's just start going through these for fun. Jake Fromm. All-American draft, Leaf. His optic card's really taken off a lot better than I thought it would. J.K. Dobbins. Gabe Davis. T. Higgins. Pretty cool game day looking card there. I can never say this guy's name right. Cardell Jones, you Ohio State fans, let me know how to say that. Sam Cowart. Paxton Lynch. Oh, my man, Eddie Lacy. I got to meet him at the Super Bowl after the 2014 season. Really cool guy. I hate that his career fizzled out as quickly as it did. Notre Dame. As if we are not going to get enough Notre Dame cards today. Chase Claypool. Mark Dunn. Mike Kofer, originally from Charlotte, North Carolina, my hometown. Matt Castle. He's made a fortune in the NFL off of basically no talent. The Cannon, Jay Cutler. Draft pick card. I'm not sure that I got a hit in here, what they would consider the hit. Maybe this Cutler card. I don't know, maybe this Dreamius Smith. I'm not sure. Overall, pretty crappy so far. I imagine these are all sports for Georgia Tech, so maybe we'll see some basketball or baseball. Some great baseball players went through Georgia Tech. But maybe not Mario. Oh, there we go. There's a basketball. Andrew Gardner. Mark Xera. Kenny Anderson. That dude could ball. Demarius Thomas. And let's see what kind of Notre Dame cards we get. Maybe a Newt Rockney. Or not. There we go, Newt Rockney. And John Latner. Overall, pretty crappy. But I enjoy opening up these boxes and seeing what we get. Some decent surprises. I'm really excited about this Eddie Lacy card. Overall, though, if you're going to, if you see one, you're going to pick it up, just realize you may get nothing, but it's all in it for fun.
Thanks for watching, guys.